y'all how are y'all doing today guys latoya love let me just first i want to invite the holy spirit into this presence right now lord we thank you i welcome you i welcome your presence lord i thank you for being who you are god thank you holy spirit help me speak to your children right now help me get this word out right now so that i can give them all of you and none of me Okay, family, I just want to tell y'all real quick. Y'all know I'm doing my son's birthday party, right? Uh, just a little get together. At, and so I booked the hotel last week. So I thought I was getting a standard queen with the couch. I mean, you know, not the standard, but the couch and all that. So when we walk in the room, um, we walks in the room and it's, you know, it's the two beds, but it ain't got the couch. So my aunt, you know, was going to stay over with me. So I'm like, okay, we got two beds. The two boys gonna sleep right there. But I I seen a vision of me being in the room with the couch because the couch will have a let out bed and then it give us all enough room to put the food, all that. So the only table I had was the TV table. And I'm like, hmm. So I immediately walked in the room, called the front desk, and um, and I said, my son, I said, before we leave, let's pray. So I pray. I said, this is the time. I said, God, go ahead and perform. Go ahead, Father, and perform this miracle. Family. Family. <laughs> Let me tell you what God did. So, okay. And I called down there. So well, on my way down there, I prayed. And I told my son, I said, see, you about to see the miracle working God that he is. And maybe God did that for a reason. Now, mind you, I got the room for $88. Plus, it was $88, some dollars plus tax and all, okay? <laughs> Let me tell you something. She said, because you booked it third party, because I booked it through Expedia, she was like, you already done checked in. She said, have you did anything? I was like, no, we just literally walked in the room and I opened up and I asked, you know, did the phone. She said... Um, she said, um, come on down. Well, I come down the steps, y'all. Go back down there. She already walked to me and had the key ready. She said, I couldn't charge you if I want to because it's already locked in. Gave me the key to the new room with the double beds, of course, with this big space with the couch and all. So you mean to tell me this is, she said, that's the executive queen, double queen. <laughs> I paid $108 for this room for the regular room but see the queen got the executive <laughs> the executive room for her child and i said look at god i already knew i didn't know what she was gonna do i thought maybe i was gonna just give her some more cash didn't have to pay no more money these let me tell you something for those of you who season this word this word is for you this word is for those who is not in, in season for restoration and where I said God is about to do the unthinkable in our lives. Just start watching the slowly manifestations of these blessings that's pouring in. Little by little. They've been beautiful, small, and just, they just. <laughs> Let me tell y'all something. That's why I've been praising God. I've been, not because of the blessings, been closer to him. If this is not your restoration season, still be, be, still be determined to stay in his presence. Still be determined to walk with him. I started going full force with God, like sold out full force in July of last year. And August, September, October, November, December, January, six months, February, seven months. Um, I completely stopped having SEX, you know, all that. I struggle with the cigarettes, but God is a merciful God. You need his grace and mercy every day. I struggle family with cigarettes, but that's another story. I want to make this quick and short. I just want to say, God is, uh, when you, he is so good. He is so good. He is so good. And y'all, let me know if you don't start to see the manifestations of your blessings start to flow in, your restoration. Think about Job. Think about Job. For those who want to quit, your latter, latter part of your life is going to be better than your former. He's going to give you double for your trouble. Do you hear me? He's going to give you double for your trouble. You're going to get double for your trouble, family, okay? Double. He's going to give you a hundredfold, triplefold. You are about to manifest in some unimaginable, unspeakable joy that can't nobody take from you. Unspeakable joy. 
God is about to do it and only he going to do it. Because you've been waiting and you've been watching and you've been praying and you've been fasting. We've been thinking it's all for vain in vain. No, it ain't. There's power. It's power when we fast and pray. But y'all be blessed for those who season. It's not for restoration. Keep going. It ain't, it ain't far from here because God is moving quickly in Jesus' name. So you guys, be blessed. Keep your head up. Don't give up. Hey, and if you haven't started to see... And you know this is your time. You've been putting that work in. You've been walking with God. You've been reading your Bible. You've been praying. You've been um, you've been doing everything. Guess what? You know when it's your time. So get ready. Get ready. See, you got to prepare your heart. That's why I've been doing these videos. You got to prepare for these blessings. You got to just prepare yourself. You got to keep pushing. It just Because the devil will fight for you, okay, to stop. No, we not stopping. We came too far. We've been going. It's just like the man... Or the lady with the issue of blood. You've been going for too long. You've been fighting. You've been fighting for years. I'm 38. I've been going through struggle and strife for 38 years since I was born. I was born into this. I was born into poverty. Glory be to God. Well, I got to go. I got to drive this car. You all be blessed and God loves you all. Don't forget to hit that like button because God loves you and so do I with the love of Christ. Bye-bye.